Something absolutely bizarre and surreal happened on Monday during a live shot of Iowa caucus coverage on Newsmax. Well, I think Trump is going to score a huge victory. I think the media is going to try to downplay it because, as you correctly said, they're basically supporting um, uh, Ron. They're basically supporting Nikki Haley. So they're going to downplay it and they're going to try to say, oh, he didn't get a majority or he got 48 percent. But some, one way or another, this is a huge victory for Donald Trump. And uh, I believe this is going to be a very short presidential race. I think this may be a knockout punch. I think that whoever, uh, I think that after this primary, uh, New Hampshire is going to be heavily for Trump. And Nevada always was. South Carolina will be, which I think will be a fatal blow to Nikki Haley because she's from there. And then you have March 5th when 45 percent of America votes. Yeah. And I think this will be over faster than a Mike Tyson fight. Did you see that? Now, look, the reason that I played the whole clip is so is to show you the reaction, right? No one said a dang thing. Like, that was Dick Morris, and then somebody else, we don't know who, casually strolling through the live shot while not wearing pants. Okay, then. Again, no one said anything about it. It's like, it's like a normal day. Like, oh, yeah, here, uh, there, uh, Dick Morris, and then Dick Morris's friend with no pants on. Wh what? Okay. <laughs> I mean, you could say, oh, maybe it was professionalism. I don't know. <laughs> it's certainly not something you see every day. Now, look, I do understand that sometimes people will crash your live shot. I get it. Like, man in the street interviews, you know, reporters are out covering something. Eh, there's bound to be somebody that gets into the shot, whatever. And by the way, everybody remembers the kid that wandered into the news report while somebody was, you know, while reporter was working at home. That was a fun, wholesome, viral moment. Even cute. This, that one cute. <laughs> okay, that was some old dude in his underwear. I got questions. Who is this guy? Where did he come from? What, what does that room lead to? I don't know. Why is he hanging out with Dick Morris? More importantly, where did his pants go? Where were they? Why is he half naked? We've got questions. The American people, they need to know. Look, Dick Morris shooting from home, right? I gotta wonder, what's the living conditions there? How did he not know, right? Is that a roommate? Who Did, did he not tell someone, hey, I'm gonna be filming. I'm gonna be live on Newsmax. So whatever you do, if you're gonna come into the room, please wear pants, okay? <laughs> could not, could he have waited? I don't know, I've got questions. I've got too many questions. This Newsmax host though, again, I don't know if it's professionalism, but it was like, didn't see nothing, not gonna ask. Forget what the interview is about. This is the real story. Who is the underwear man and why is Newsmax covering it up? I'm just asking questions.